morning. morning. What's up, beautiful people? We've woken up to our first beautiful morning here in Exmoor. The weather's brightening up. That means today we're gonna go out and we're gonna hopefully have a little bit of a beach day. Today we're going to a beach called Broad Sands Beach, which is about an hour from Porlock Weir. We watched um, a video of a couple that went there and they said it looked like Jurassic Park. So we're gonna see for ourselves. We're just driving through. This is Porlock. Piggy Anna's in the middle. Driving. Piggy in the middle. What? It's, it's a fish and chip shop, but it's called Piggy in the middle. <laughs> this is like a mile away from Porlock Weir, the little village on the coast. Country roads. Oh Ooh, God. this is steep. Struggle. This is so steep, oh my god. We soon found out this was Porlock Hill, famous for being the steepest A road in all of England. Nice! Did not enjoy that one bit. <laughs> That's terrifying. I haven't been on a road that steep for a very long time. I think this is the road we were gonna we were trying to avoid. Somehow we missed a turn and we're now, instead of like going more on the, the main A road round the, close to the coast, we've come more inland right through towards like the middle of the Exmoor National Park. Like we are right in the middle of Exmoor National Park. <laughs> and it's very up and down and right now we're kind of like in a cloud. You can see all this low cloud around here. That would be absolutely stunning views if we could see them. Look at them! Hello friends! Hello! There's little baby ones! Right, let's go straight on. I don't want any of them charging at me. <laughs> Good spot by you. Yeah, we were just in the middle of another conversation and I was like, and then, dear! <laughs> Nice. I don't think we could have got a better spot if we tried, eh? Perfect. Well, it wasn't quite the route we expected, so it took us a little bit longer. Parked in a place called Watermouth or Watermouth. It's a cute little harbour. Which is very cute. We're going to pay, I think it's £7 to park here for the whole day. And it's only like a 15 minute walk away from Broad Sands, Broad Sands Beach where you want to be. We nailed it actually. Absolutely nailed it! And the sun! The sun is out! It's like the first time the sun's been out on the whole drive was as we were approaching uh, this, little, this little town area, so... <laughs> Hannah's found this lovely little cafe here. So we're going to stop and hopefully get a little coffee. Gonna stop for a little coffee? At the storm in a teacup. Is that my little sausage roll in here? This is my pasta. What have you got? Butternut squash, spinach and feta pa pasty, and an oat milk flat white. Cheers. Cheers. Up from me. Back on the coast path. Now we just got to wander a little bit further on. We've been refueled by pasty and, and sausage, sausage roll, roll and coffee. Walking through a campsite, then we join the actual path, ready for the beach steps. Oh yeah, apparently it's like 230 something steps down to the beach or something. Which is fun on the way down. But exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> Maybe not on the way back. <laughs> on the way back up after you're super relaxed and tired. Look at that for a place to pitch. Perfect. It's quite scary on like a stormy day though, I think. Yeah, right on the edge. Right on the edge. This is why the steps go all the way down. Because <laughs> first yeah. we're going all the way up. Oh, look. That's where we had our coffees. Oh, that's the beach. That is gorgeous. Look, at, Look that. at that. Oh my life. Look at that blue. And if ever we saw one, this. A PPP. A perfectly, perfectly placed, placed bench. Bench. Left 
turn and then go down the steps. Look at all this wild garlic. Oh, it smells amazing. Look. And that's like a few hundred meters further, that's it, from the campsite. And now we're gonna go down to the beach. Oh my God, have you seen this? Up here, there's a little sign just off the path. Danger adders. I would rather not see one, especially if it was biting me. I know, no thanks. baby. Not bad. Got a little tour coming in over here. Let's see if we can get any waves. I actually can't believe this. This is bank holiday Monday when everyone's off work. It's a super sunny day and there's fewer than 20 people on this incredible beach with like it's a secluded cove, super turquoise water and you've got all of these lovely little owl covey bits. The coast path just runs along the top up here. I mean I just can't I can't fathom that there's this few people here. really trying to muster up the confidence and willpower to go in the sea. It's just not quite coming yet, but I, <laughs> I think it would be really nice once you're in and once you've braved that first dip, getting the head under, but I'm not quite there yet. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> I don't know why I bothered putting sliders on when I could have just gone barefoot and not got them completely soaking, but <laughs> there we are. These are not the best Ooh. climbing shoes. Oh God. This is not the best route. <laughs> right. Oh, look at this. Ah. The water here is just about to meet. And then all of our stuff is just like up here somewhere. What a location. Oh my life. <laughs> She's off. It's time to go. I do not want to be stranded on this bit for the next few hours. Oh, I'm freezing! Are <laughs> <laughs> you very Look at that accessory. Stylish. Could I be more cool? Wait for it, wait for it. Look at that. I'm I actually do think it looks quite cool, I'm not gonna lie. That was a very good day. Very, very good day. I did not make it into the sea. I was very close, I had my shorts in my hand <laughs> and then the clouds came over and I was no, like, no thank you. Afterwards. Paddling was enough for me today. Outdoor walk, let's go. <sighs> One sixty. Three. That really wasn't too bad. And also, you know what else? No adders. No adders. I would have quite liked to have swum, but it was too chilly. I think My it's feet. always a, like a good idea until you get out and then you're freezing. And it's still May, remember? We should get a dry robe. Well, we should get multiple I would dry love robes. to Otherwise, get a dry robe. Always Otherwise, I would always steal your dry robe. Hello, Penelope. Nice. Just driven about five minutes further along the coast, well, back along the coast, to we're Coombe, Coombe Martin. Martin. We met a couple today and they were living in Coombe Martin. They suggested that we go to this chippy for dinner, so. And that's exactly what we're, we're doing. Going. <laughs> yeah, boy! 
Let's go to the beach. Let's get you up it. It's very cute here. Yeah. Oh, look at this. I like that roof terrace. I am so excited for fish and chips on the beach. <gasps> we can sit on the Maybe edge squidge there. them. Don't squidge the fish and chippies. Oh, this looks dangerous. Oh, it's a funny face. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Look at that view. The moment of truth. It's enormous. Cheers. <laughs> Wait for it. There it is. Can you see it? Yeah. So oh. lovely. So we got Coo Martin just down here, and we were sitting just over here, like down here somewhere with our fish and chips. And we saw there were some more steps that came over, but randomly they've put a wall in just there. So we had to vault over the, <laughs> the wall because we thought the sunset would be better up here. It's so much better up here. <laughs> Massive thanks to The Best of Exmoor for hosting us on this trip. The Best of Exmoor is a local family-run business offering a huge selection of self-catering cottages in the area. Click the link in the description and use the code Loz's Leisure, or snap the QR code on screen now and you'll get £30 off any holiday cottage stay on their website. If you've enjoyed this video, please leave it a like and consider subscribing for more. Ding! Thank you so much for watching. Big love. And it feels good around here. That. Sorry. I was asleep. Already? Yeah. Sorry. I was tired. You just oh, I put a crab on me. Naughty.